film photography has become increasingly popular in the last decade. An ongoing barrier to taking film photographs is the difficulty of processing the film. There aren't photo processing facilities on every corner like there were 30 years ago. Home processing gives fast turnaround times, but requires lots of manual labor and careful attention to detail. Mail order processing services are more convenient, but take weeks to get your film back and adds considerable shipping costs to and from the lab. My name is Matt Beckberger. Three years ago, I founded Raveni Labs, a company dedicated to solving the problems of modern film photographers. With two successful Kickstarter campaigns under my belt, I've returned a third time with an eye on bringing lab processing convenience to the home. I've created the DunkBot, a tabletop automatic film processing machine. Using a simple design, it brings the convenience of lab processing to you with the speed and cost savings of home processing. The DunkBot uses a crane-like robotic arm to dip a lightproof film tank through six chemical baths, processing the film while you wait. Liquids flow in and out through the bottom light trap. Air flows in and out through the top light trap. Setting up the DunkBot is straightforward. Load your film into the developing reel. Insert the reel into the lightproof developing tank. Prepare the six one liter pots by filling each with the appropriate chemicals and water. Attach the developing tank, configure the machine using the color touchscreen, and press start. The dunk bot will heat the chemicals to the appropriate temperatures using the heated pads under each pot and begin the film processing automatically. The film is moved from pot to pot via the crane-like mechanical arm. Once the final step is completed, the machine beeps to let you know that the film is ready to be hung up to dry. Once dry, you can scan your film or use it in the darkroom to make enlargement prints. The DunkBot can develop two rolls of 35mm or one roll of 120 film at a time. For cleanup, just remove the pots, pour the chemicals back into their storage bottles for reuse, and pour the rinse water down the drain. Everything is easy to clean to prevent cross-contamination. With this fully working prototype and the major design considerations complete, I've come to Kickstarter to gauge the interest of the film photography community and to get the funds required to purchase the components in bulk. This is critical to getting the per unit cost to an acceptable level. To further reduce costs and shipping size, the DunkBot will be sold as a self-assemble kit. It will also be available in a mostly assembled version for a higher cost. A successful Kickstarter campaign means I can proceed with further development of the user interface, touchscreen controls, assembly documentation, user manual, and how-to videos. Your support will keep Revenia Labs working for the future of film photography. Thank you.